This video is designed to show you how to create a quiz within Kahoot. The first thing you will need to do is go to create.kahoot.it and then after that you'll want to sign in using your email and password that you already created and once you type that in click sign in and then that will take you to your Kahoot dashboard. Now you'll be able to review previous Kahoots that you've already created and reuse them. You also have access to public Kahoots at the top, also some FAQs, and then any support you might need along the way. Now in order to create a new Kahoot, you can click New K or simply click what type of a Kahoot you would like to create. And for this video, we're going to create a quiz, so you'll click Quiz. And then you want to start by giving the quiz a name. Now Kahoot is a great tool to use to review vocabulary words within Lead 21. So I'm going to title my Kahoot quiz Unit 2 Week 2 Vocabulary. And then after you've given your quiz a title, you can click Go. And now you'll be able to start creating questions. So you'll be able to see, you can go back and edit the title if you would like. We have question one right here, and the total amount of characters that you can have for question one you can see is 95 characters. If you want to create this as a game, you'll keep points questions, or you can do no points questions. So I'm going to keep that this as points question. That'll be the default. It's also a default for each question that every student will get 20 seconds to answer it. Now, if you would like to increase that, to 30, 60, 90, or 120 seconds, or even decrease it to 5 or 10. I usually go with the default of 20 seconds per question. Now for the sake of this video, I am not going to be putting images or anything like that, but if you would like to add images to each question, you can do that as well. So you'll type your question in this box at the top next to where it says question 1. So you can see I made my question fill in the blank. And then I'll scroll down to the bottom. I can have up to four choices for that fill in the blank question, or I can limit it to two different choices. So I'll just make four choices and I'll type in the multiple choice answers in each box. So I have included the four different vocabulary words from unit two, week two, and then I'll just need to click the correct answer. And then I have the option to save and continue, and that will finish my quiz, or I can add another question. So I'm going to add another question, and now I have question two. Now for question two, I'm just asking a question, what is the act of studying to learn facts? And then I will scroll down and I'll type my answers here at the bottom. Now that I've typed all my answers in, I will click research for the correct answer. And then I will add another question. And for this question, I'm doing a true or false question. So I have true or false. Species means a group, a group of plants or animals that have similar characteristics. And then I will scroll down, and I will need to eliminate two of the possible answers by clicking that minus sign. And then I'll just simply type true, false, and then I'll click correct underneath true. Now, usually with a quiz within Kahoot, you will, you will want more than just three questions. But for this video, we're going to finish the quiz. So you will click Save and Continue after you've typed in all the questions that you would like within your quiz. Now, I'll take you to this screen, and you do have the option to reorder questions by dragging and dropping them into place. If you'd like to order where they are already, you can click Save and Continue again. Now it will take you to this screen where Kahoot wants to know a little bit more about your quiz. If you like to keep it in English, that's fine. Or another language, you can change it to that as well. If you would like to have the private or public, so public means that anybody can use your Kahoot quiz that you've created. I'll just keep it at public and then the primary audience, so school, university, business, training, event, social. So we'll do school. If you'd like to add a description, you can. If you would like to add tags, you can. I will not in this video, so I'm going to click Save and Continue. Now, if you would like to add a cover image for your quiz, you can just by 
choosing the file and attaching an image to the Kahoot quiz, I am not going to do that in this video. Then I will click Done. Now you do have the option to preview the quiz, to edit the quiz, or you can play now. So I'm going to click Play Now. And there are still a few more options that you have within the Kahoot quiz. I usually keep them at the default, but you can change them however you would like. Then if you would like to begin the game, you'll click Launch. And then after you do that, you'll be able to see a pin that students will use to join the game. So they will just go to Kahoot.it. That's all they will go to. So Kahoot.it. And they'll type in the pin to the game, five, five, one, two, three zeros, and eight. And each Kahoot quiz will have its own specific pin. And then the student will click Enter. And they'll connect to the Kahoot. They'll have a name. They'll click OK. Then you will have all your students' names populate up on your screen. If you have an inappropriate name or a goofy name up there, you can just simply click that name and it'll take it off of the screen and that person won't be a part of the Kahoot until they have a name that's acceptable. And then you'll click Start and that will begin the Kahoot. And that is how you create a quiz within Kahoot. Now if you're not going to use your Kahoot right away and just want to create it and save it for another day, I'll show you how to retrieve an already created Kahoot quiz. So you'll go back to Create dot kahoot dot it you'll sign in and then you'll want to go where it says my kahoots so click on that and then for example unit two week two vocabulary i'll just click play and i'll be able to follow the instructions that were previously on this video so that concludes the video on how to create a quiz within kahoot